Okay, welcome and thank you for coming back to Dennis RC. Um, here we've got uh, our latest work. Um, we've got the mechanics tied to the fuselage here to control the uh, gun actuation mechanism. So uh, basically what we can do now is with the transmitter we can retract and extend the pods. Lighting and pneumatics are not yet installed, but that needs to come in just a little bit. There's a gap there. And then the you can see the mechanism that actually actuates it right there. Nice and compact. They both get routed to a JR matchbox here, which uh, allows me to do the fine adjustments on either side, uh, which we'll do here prior to the next step, which is going to be the sequencers, of course, to uh, activate the pneumatics um, at the same time, uh, or shortly after the gun pods are extended. Uh, this little light right here uh, illuminates through these brass extension tubes. Uh, you can see the wiring that we've just run here. That goes to the back of the individual outer tubes. Uh, so we're just uh, moving right along here and uh, sort of a major step getting these to actually uh, slide in and out and function smoothly and etc uh, etc. Et we're using a pair of 8711 um, servos so that uh, we've got plenty of torque and uh, the uh, gun pods will certainly deploy prior to the extension of the prior to the extension of the guns because as you can see it would be a bad thing if they extended before the pod the pod did anyway that's where we are here on this final this step and uh, uh, next, we'll come back to you with the uh, the lighting and the uh, gun extension. Thanks again for stopping by DennisRC.com.